This is the AX 7 millimeter steel penetrating coil gun in its entirety. It runs off batteries so it can be portable. Operation is just this power switch to turn it on. This charges it. And this fires the coils. So if we charge it, it goes blue. When it turns red, it's ready to fire. It's ready to go. We press this to fire it. Now we can charge again just by pressing here. There's no optics between the coils, so it doesn't run with optics. The bullet follows the magnetic flux. By law of magnetic flow, you know where the bullet is with the pulse width of each coil. To get it so powerful, I used many capacitors in parallel to lower the ESR down to where it's efficient. There's 43 capacitors and 60 SCRs, 10 SCRs per coil. This right here is a 2.5 kilowatt pulse charger. It's capable of charging up the capacitor in about 4 seconds. So it can basically charge it as fast as you can reload it. This is a sequencer right here. It's 6 stages and it's tunable. So if you want to look at some pulse waveforms, here they are on the scope. This is the first and second stage. First stage in red, second stage in blue. Here's the sequencer. It's in charge of firing all six coils. Five, five, five timers right here. Forty ninety three Schmidt trigger. On the other side is six optocouples. This just isolates the high voltage from the electronics a little bit 
so that there's no screw up in the shot sequence reliable accurate every time you could just stage two three four five and six to get the optimum speed these are the projectiles that I shoot they're just fiddle spits that's all there's a square tip that's the one I put through the steel Thank you for watching the Yak Electromagnetic Coil Pulse Cannon.